All right, guys, just back here with another video. So today, um, I was just, uh, as you know, I'm a big Robert Kennedy Jr. supporter, and uh, his vice presidential pick was a lady named Nicole Shanahan, and uh, she's, you know, she's very good. I was skeptical about the pick um, at first, but she's actually one of those former Democrats who have flipped to be independent because she disagrees with what the Democrats are doing so much, to the point where they are now actually both supporting Donald Trump. So. Uh, she did make this uh, this video ad, just basically kind of roasting the Democrats. So I did wanted to show you that because it is pretty funny. Uh, also, before we do get into that, please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. It really does help me grow. And uh, please also don't forget to like and subscribe just because I do also enjoy uh, reading and uh, engaging with your comments as well. So without further ado, let's get into this video and then we'll talk about it just a little bit after. Are you or your loved ones suffering from illnesses such as TDS, also known as Trump derangement syndrome? Do you dismiss or deny the current issues facing our country, such as historic inflation, illegal immigration, corporate corruption, World War III escalations, and the chronic disease epidemic? Are you willing to elect someone who was the least popular vice president in modern history, and who offers no policy or vision for America, simply because your brain keeps telling you anyone but Trump? If so, you might be struggling from TDS. Introducing Independence Independence allows you the freedom to finally think independently once again. Instead of believing everything you hear from the mainstream media, independence allows for constructive critical thinking. I used to hear people on the news say things like Donald Trump and the movement he has encouraged are a threat to democracy. And I instantly believed it. <laughs> With Independence, I now realize the media is run by the Democrat elite, who are a corrupt oligarchy that censors free speech silences political opponents, supports forever wars, and abandons democracy by anointing its candidates. Independence may not be for everyone. If you enjoy being lied to about your president's cognitive abilities, support Orwellian totalitarianism, or are excited about communist fiscal policy, independence may not be right for you. Common side effects of independence may include an awakening of rational thought, successfully identifying propaganda, freedom of choice, loss of hatred, anti-narcissistic behavior, and love of democracy. I used to blindly hate whoever my party was running against. I didn't care about facts or policy because I was hopelessly indoctrinated. With independence, I'm much more interested in policies that uphold democracy, and I truly care about the health of our country and its citizens. Ask your doctor if independence is right for you, and enjoy your freedoms once again. I mean, first of all, that was, that was beautiful and absolutely true. All the things that they said about, oh, hey, you know, if you like war, if you like propaganda, if you don't vote about policies, you just vote because you hate Donald Trump, you might have TDS. It's it's absolutely true, right? So what I'm going to ask of you guys, if you don't mind, because it doesn't have a lot of views on YouTube. Let me actually check this out here. Uh, yeah, so it's, it was posted a day ago. It's got just under 10,000 views. This should have millions of views because it's, it's amazing and it's hilarious and it's true. So if you know a Democrat, show them this video, post it on your social media. I don't know if you guys you know, are on there much like TikTok or X, but if you are, post it there, repost it. And just let the Democrats know that this is how not only independents see you, but how these new age Republicans see you as well. It's not just the right. It's everyone except the left. That's It's not right versus left anymore. It's the left versus everybody. And they're losing still think they're going to win the election but hey we'll uh we'll cover that um <clears throat> probably closer to the election day on getting official uh predictions and whatnot but please share this video because it's very well done and it's funny and it's also true right the truth is easier to be told when it's also or it's easier to tell when you have like a, a, an entertaining message to go along with it so definitely uh do that and also let me know what you think in the comments about this video do you agree with, with what they were saying? Do you also agree with the fact that the parties seem to be realigning? If you look at what's happening right now with the Democrats, they're getting support from Republicans. Yeah, from Bush, Cheney, Romney type of Republicans. The pro-war Republicans, the rhinos is what they're called, they're now supporting Kamala. Mega Republicans are supporting Trump and Former Democrats like Tulsi Gabbard and Robert Kennedy, good Democrats, are actually joining Trump. And I've even heard rumors Bernie Sanders might join Trump. That would be insane. That would 
I mean, it's already solidified in my opinion, but that would solidify like the mainstream public. If you're a lefty and Bernie joins Trump, I mean, what do you, what do you, I think their heads would explode. It'd be, it'd be kind of, you know, funny to, to see their reaction to that. But it, it is funny because when you look at the you know, immigration policies, when you look at the war policies from Trump compared to Kamala, he's actually on the left of Kamala Harris. Kamala, Kamala Harris is on the right. So is Joe Biden. On those issues, though, with 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 Trump finally talking about the chronic health disease, uh, health issues with kids in America, that's way to the left of Kamala. So you're almost kind of seeing the the, the Democrats go right and the Republicans actually start to go a little bit left here. It's really interesting to see. But let me know what you guys think about uh, if you think if do you see what I see with the realignment of the parties, and also let me know what you think about this uh, great ad that was put out by the wonderful Nicole Shanahan. So that's going to be it for this video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe again. And also let me know what you're thinking in the comment section. Thanks again for watching and I'll be back shortly with a new video.